Hi, I'm here at the Millionaire Corner, and we're at the Writer's Block, and we have a new writer on the block, and his name is Kent. So I'm going to introduce you to Kent. How are you doing today, Kent? I'm good, thank you. Can you give us a little background on your writing and what you sort of specialize in? Well, I spent 25 years as a sports writer. I covered the Chicago Bulls uh, for the Daily Herald from 1988 to 1999 when they were winning all their championships. <laughs> and um, I've written two books about the Chicago Bulls and have two more coming out. Uh, but about five years ago, I got out of the sports writing business and started writing business features, again for the Daily Herald um, that I had been working for, and um, did a lot of freelance, and then um, hooked up here. So Kent, what are you gonna be writing about? Um, got a story coming up about gold. Um, it's a hot topic these days because the price is dropping so uh, rapidly and there's it's dropping well it is yeah so I mean there's all sorts of concerns in regards to uh, whether gold is a good investment anymore just who's investing in it and then um, we also have a story about finding um, an advisor an investment advisor uh, which is something that we regularly do and sort of an update it's the best way to go about doing that how you doing today Donald well every year around this time I am reminded of my days as a country club lifeguard and every year around the 4th of July there was a member who would walk around the deck and say have a fifth on the 4th <laughs> so it's 4th of July week and I always think of him to this day and we also have uh, stories you know related to the 4th of July um, to see if this patriotic fervor uh, extends to shopping habits. Are consumers uh, making a point to buy products that are made in America? Are they supporting local businesses or are they you know, just going for the best deal and going to the local uh, you know, national chain? And we have um, some stories up on the, on the site right now. Um, later this week, we will have the all-important uh, jobs report to, to look at that comes out on Friday. Last month, uh, as I recall, the economy added 170,000 jobs. Wow. Uh, well, they were mostly primarily in lower paid retail jobs. So, uh, so we will see um, how that pans out this month. All right, well those are gonna be some great stories, so make sure you stop by the block and check out these stories and more. I'm Heather Kiley, thanks for watching. Oh, oh yes. May the fourth be with you. Okay.